Lord. Hi lovelies, happy Friday. I'm Caroline from A Meaningful Blog where I talk about anything having to do with life, health, school, and planning. Today I'm going to be taking you on a tour of my new Gramercy by Recollections craft cart that I'm using to store and organize all of my planner supplies. If you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos like this, make sure to click subscribe. If you saw my Instagram stories last week, you might have seen this video of the two drawers that I had completely filled with planner supplies. Now I'm very happy to say that only one drawer is halfway full with not planner supplies. That wouldn't have been possible without my new craft cart by recollection. In our current apartment, there is nowhere for me to keep the cart next to my desk, so we keep it over here by this mirror in our kind of entryway. And I can just roll the cart over to my desk and take the things off that I need. When it's at my desk, I can pull off anything that I need from stickers to washi tape to extra paper and I can put it all into my planner. And then when I'm done, I can put everything back on the cart. The first side just has my planners on a shelf and half of my washi tape. The end has a basket with a paper punch, scissors, a ruler, an X-Acto knife, and all of my stickers that are no longer in sticker books. The third side has my second roll of washi tape as well as a rack of stickers that are not Happy Planner brand. And the top has all of my sticker books that are still intact and are Happy Planner brand. I also have Happy Planner sticky notes sheets and pages that I like to keep in my planner, but I can't right now because my planner is so bulky. I also have sticker sheets that are no longer a part of a sticker book, and their circle broke, so they won't hang, as well as a sticker book that won't hang is not a part of Happy Planner. and sticker sheets that came in box sets or from Walmart. Now moving on to the middle basket where I keep all of the planners that make up the planner that I carry around with me. Starting with my recipe planner and then my faith planner. This is my biz babe planner with last year's cover on it and my catch-all planner with a DIY cover on it. I also have a punch here. Now moving to the last basket, which has a big notebook filled with excess paper. I also have two big pads of designer scrapbook paper. And these two notebooks. This one has half sheets of paper and pocket pages. And this one has envelopes in it, dividers, and pocket folders. I also have these block pads of paper that have my name and a flute on them. And finally, stickers that are too big to fit on the top and that I really don't use that often. I usually use them for school projects and things like that. If you like that tour, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos like this, click subscribe below and make sure to hit the notification bell. I post videos on Friday mornings about life, health, school, and planning. Stay lovely and have a meeting.